Singapore. The values of science and technology shape our lives. To recycle wastewater, we have invented bioprogrammable hollow fiber membranes that require less energy and pressure to recycle wastewater. Our achievements in eye research have improved how eye diseases are treated and prevented on a global scale. We are committed to invest in technologies of tomorrow and as a leading quantum research center in Asia. The spirit of science keeps us curious and inspires us to connect and learn from one another. By working together, we pool our knowledge and expertise to push boundaries in science. Knowledge will help us confidently progress into the future. Despite uncertainties and evolving challenges, At the GYSS, speakers and panelists will share about new possibilities. Here is where the marvels of innovation, science and technology come together to excite and inspire a new generation of young scientists. When I first met them, also, of course I was a bit nervous. I mean, they are top scientists after all. But after a while, like the friendship developed, then you just ask any genuine curious question and they share with us their experience of being in the field. So besides the scientists, they also credited their success to the huge team that was with them throughout the journey because what's one scientist without the team, right? I was the liaison officer for Professor Stuart Parking. He was a Millennium Tech Prize winner, awarded for his contributions in Spintronic. He often asked this question, what is scientific impact? And typically scientific impact is evaluated by certain metrics based on these various standards. Are we producing less quality science than our forefathers? This question made me think that how should we make our science findings more impactful? What we have concluded is that we are indeed producing more science. Our recent developments in vaccines and astronomy are great examples of how a better scientific environment can allow us to produce better science in general. When I first met Prof. Aaron, he looks quite serious. I was a bit nervous because you are meeting someone who is a giant in the field. So during these small group discussions, we got to interact with Prof. Aaron and the rest of the participants from all over the world. So we discussed our research interests, our research questions, like anything in the field that we are not clear about. He emphasized that even tiny contributions to science are still contributions towards improving the human health. And this just reminded me of why I wanted to become a biomedical scientist and just encouraged me to keep going. I think at the end of the day, URSS is an international platform where it brings all these scientists together. It also allows you to like showcase your research and the connections that you build, which will last you for a long period of time. Because we know that in science, you need a strong sense of collaboration from many different fields. It's a chance to get inspired by the top scientists as well. And if you're lucky enough, you get to continue friendships. Mm -hmm.